the the, the bottom line is this is um, uh, here. I'm sure, are you familiar with Ozzy Mendias? Yeah. Okay. I have a recording of him on here, and uh, where in one part of the recording, uh, he criticizes circular reasoning, and then another part of the recording, he says everything comes down to circular reasoning. So, I mean, he's one of the more uh, eloquent, uh, philosophically educated people on here, and yet he contradicts himself. Like he talks to me, like he he'll say, for example, uh, he questioned me. For, we didn't have very long to speak because I had one of my stalkers in the room um, about falsification and God being falsifiable. An, an atheist can't even uh, address the idea of falsifiability. You just, you just, you just said, you just said that, you, that, that that the Christian God was falsifiable, and you've been asked uh, uh, by um, Jack, and now I'm asking the same questions. Why I entered the hangout? Could you specify? Sure, you finding the dead body of Jesus Christ. Right. So we're just completely at a loss here, Darwin, to understand your position. On the one hand, you seem to be arguing that the Duem Quine thesis shows that things can't be falsified, and then you're saying that the dead body of Christ would falsify the Christian God. So what is your position? It just seems to be a mess. I actually had a serious question for Dawkins. I remember at one point you said that finding the body of Jesus Christ would be the falsifying piece of evidence to falsify God. But since we haven't found the body of Jesus Christ, we haven't... Right? Richard Carrier. Is there, is, there, is there a question in there? No, I was just... Um, I want to make sure if that's the thing you've said. No, I said uh, if one presumes the possibility of falsification in one's worldview, that would be a, for the first prerequisite. Following that presumption, one way one could falsify Christianity would be to find the dead body of Jesus Christ. That's an interesting now have, caveat. You, now, you have, now, you have to understand... Um, debate coliseum that when you're going to quote me just make sure you're doing so from actually hearing what I say rather than what people say I have said on Google Plus Because you you can't you can't you can't assert anything as the case, you can't say anything. It's not a question of whether it's possible or impossible. You can affirm nothing. 